Terminator Dark Fate is a science fiction action film and is directed by Tim Miller and stars Linda Hamilton, Arnold Schwarzenegger, and Mackenzie Davis. So this film has been getting quite a bit of a mixed response, with some of the responses leaning more towards the negative. And there have been a few people who have said that this is an unworthy addition to the Terminator series. And it's not that bad. Like, okay, it's not as smart or clever as Terminator 1 and 2, but for what this movie was, I thought it was entertaining. It told a pretty decent story, even though it did retread Terminator 1 and 2 a little bit. But at the very least, I think this film is much better than the last three Terminator films. To get it out of the way, I'll talk about my negatives on the film. Firstly, a majority of the CGI looks like absolute crap. In some uses of CGI, it looked impressive, but when the filmmakers constantly had to use CGI, oh my god, it looked absolutely fake. And it was quite easy to tell what was real and what wasn't. I also wasn't too huge on the Danny character. Essentially, she's just another John Connor. The film as well could be a little bit predictable at points, as, like I said, Dark Fate likes to retread Terminator 1 and 2 a lot. And that's just about all my negatives on the film. The rest of the film, like I said, is entertaining. Despite the actress who played the Danny character, everyone else did a good job. Linda Hamilton once again kicks ass as Sarah Connor. Mackenzie Davis is the shining star in this movie, and I honestly see this as a breakthrough performance. As she's had a couple of bit performances here and there, like The Martian and Blade Runner 2049, but here in Dark Fate, this is the first time I got to see a lot more of her, and I liked what she did in this movie. She very much had a presence to her, and Arnold Schwarzenegger was actually one of the highlights of the film for me. Every time he was on screen, he was the most entertaining part of it, and he also brought a bit of humor to the film which I welcomed. Some of the action scenes I thought were well done. And yes, while some of the CGI could get very obnoxious during these scenes, these action scenes still kept my interest and not once did I ever find them to be dull. Something that will either make or break this movie for a lot of people is the opening, as some may say that this opening is a big screw you to Terminator 2, and I will admit that this opening is a hard pill to swallow, but over the course of the film, I was able to accept it because of the story they introduced. Overall, Dark Fate is not a perfect movie. Some of the CGI looks like absolute shit. The middle did drag on mainly because it was so exposition heavy. The Danny character could have been developed better, and a few other dumb parts that could have been removed, but Dark Fate was able to maintain my interest because of the characters played by Linda Hamilton, Mackenzie Davis, and Arnold Schwarzenegger, and the action scenes as well I found enjoyable. And while I think Terminator Dark Fate is the third best film in the series, it's still a pretty average movie, and I'm going to give Terminator Dark Fate a 7 out of 10. Thank you so much for watching, if you like what you see, be sure to my Facebook page, follow me on Twitter, and subscribe to my channel below. As always, I'm Netix5, thank you for watching.